Okay, everyone. Uh, get ready to listen to this beat for a while. <laughs> there was a little chest in there. Oh my god. Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. Uh, hi, Ocarina. You get it. There we go. Okay. Oh, that was easier than I was scared it would be. Alright, the one on the right is a heart, the one on the left is a trap. Oh, fucking bitches. You did do it right. Yay, recovery heart. Tight. Oh, tight. Beeping's gone. Ow. Got him. Well, oh, you're getting fucked up, dude. <laughs> Ah, fuck him. Are you gonna get the other chest? No, that's a trap. You gotta melt it. Oh, this shit. I remember this. Remember this? I didn't like that temple. That was a funky ass temple. The the water temple? The one you gotta like bring all the flames in. Oh, it. the ice and yeah, that was the precursor to the water temple. Ugh. That one, I I don't like that part of the game. That one kind of yeah. sucks. Okay. Why, what, what are you timed for? Do you push this shit? Yep. Don't fuck up. Alright. Go on the left side. Push. Oh, I see. Now we gotta equip the Megaton Hammer here. And we're gonna fucking smash it! <laughs> <laughs> Opens. Uh, duck down, Link. I'm just gonna... <laughs> yeah! Heart! Good there hasn't been a lot of enemies around here. No. And... <laughs> okay... Oh, it's a lady! Oh, right, you gotta- you can see all the bitches. It's, um, yeah, it's- what's her name? Fuck, we forgot the fucking timer! Oh my god! Why do we always forget the damn timer?! It's like we've been doing this for years, you I think know. we know. So I'm pretty sure the only ones we have left here, because we did three of them, so I'm, I'm fairly certain the only ones we have left are fire and shadow. Alright, uh, I need to equip... Oh, shit, one's a truth. Mm. I hated this because you run out of magic so quick. Fuck. Oh, I'm sorry, am I boring you? No, I said honk. Yonk. Oh, there you go. There you go. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, whoa, that was, whoa. That was terrible. The hearts. Fucking, Fucking rupee. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus Christ. How many episodes have we been locked to 200? Too many. Like, half the series? I think half the series. Cause that one time I was like, bitch, upgrade it, and then we upgraded it, and then it sat there. Yeah, well... Sorry. It's, it's whatever. We didn't I really just, buy much of anything I, I just in this hate game. that mechanic as an idea. Yeah. It just pisses me off every time I see 200. Is there no music in this place? Ah! <laughs> Damn. What? Is there no music? Uh, no, I don't think so. It's supposed to be like spooky castle, no, no song. You don't get a song. Uh, you get a song later. Is it like? He's that, like, welcome uh, to Ganon's castle. Yeah, he wrote it himself. <laughs> we have lots of snacks. <laughs> oh, that he, you killed that bitch. Remember him? I feel like a magic game show host with this microphone. Oh yeah, it's very. Magic. Long and thin, and it's got a little pop filter on it. And I so feel you're like, like I should be on the Price Is Right. Are you Drew Carey? No, I don't. I don't want. I want to be Drew Carey. Be Drew Carey. <laughs> Why not, Drew Carey? I'd be like any other game show host. Drew Carey is at like the bottom. Whoa! What the fuck happened there? I would pick fucking. Howie Mandel over Drew Carey. Well, Howie's dope. I don't know. He's alright. Okay, who's your favorite? Who's your favorite, then? Like, legit? Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, it's gonna spit me out. Is that game over? Yeah. Alright. Oh, my God. I swear to God. You guys are getting close. Do you think they sell replicas of that as a flashlight? 
I hope not. <laughs> I would, uh, look at it. I would think about it, maybe. Well, have you ever, like, legit he gives looked the, into He gives it? a good suck. Have you, know? you, have you looked into a flashlight ever? No, never legitimately. Only ever as, like, a joke. I thought, I, I, I thought, like... <laughs> if they had, like, single-use ones, I'd feel a lot more comfortable. But it's like... You gotta reuse your shit. God, it's just fucking coming in this thing. Like, I don't wanna use that thing. <laughs> Man, do I just be dumping loads in them? <laughs> <laughs> but like, I I don't know it. I know what you mean. In, in a way, I in a way, I think they are looked down upon a lot more when when dildos have become very normalized. Okay. Like you know, like it's it's not it's not like oh she has a dildo. It's like, I think it's very much just like, yeah, girls have dildos. Yeah. Um, but, but when someone hears you have a flashlight, it's like, ew! Oh my god, that was a shot in the dark and that I was, nailed it. That was tight. Um, <laughs> that was, I'm sorry, that was what? I don't know what it was. <laughs> I'm talking about flashlights. Um, I know. <laughs> um, but no, yeah, I know, you what, know what, what you mean. mean. I know what you mean, where it's, it's like a girl like a has a dildo. Standard. And, yeah. Um, there is the golden gauntlets, cool. now we can go back and get the magic thing. In short, what the fuck, guys? Buy more flashlights. Buy more. Buy, buy more. You know what? I'm gonna die real quick. More flashlights need to be stuck on car windows so they become normalized. <laughs> it's the only way. I don't you know. hear me? It's the only way. <laughs> I don't. Maybe like stick them on flagpoles. Get creative. The, like I, I get it. Dildos can be suction cupped, but the, you got you got prime real estate in that flashlight. Hey, you, you know can what? Put a lot of things in there. You know what? Honestly, quite honestly, hey guys, hey, l hey, listen, listen. All right. Uh, yes. We need suction cup flashlights. Why? You could put How them on. You work? could put them on like the wall and fuck the wall. <laughs> well, that's <laughs> that's that's why they have the. Have you seen those like those asses? Yes. It's like an ass, and then you it's like it, right? Okay, so <laughs> it's like it's an ass. Asses? Um. You can, like, take in and out the flashlight part. Yeah. It's like that. Yes. I guess it's not really... I'm on board with what you're saying. Uh... I also... I'm out of magic. Oh. God damn it. it twinkle right. your fingers? Does that help? No. Alright, cut real quick. I gotta... I, I actually have to go just get some magic, so... Oh, this timer's off, but I'll, I'll pause it anyway. Big funky dino nads. Oh, let's get dumpy. <laughs> Time to get dumpy. Let's dumpy, get fucking dumpy. Dumpy, 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 dumpy. dumpy. What's that song? Is that? Whenever I hear it's time to get funky, funky, f I always, I always go to the fucking jelly SpongeBob song. I don't know why. <laughs> why? I, I don't know. It just fits in my head. I guess so. God, that was twenty years ago. That song. At this point, yeah. Oh yeah, good point. That was. It, At least it was like 20, 20 years ago. It can either be 21 years ago. Probably season one or two. I'm pretty sure it's season one. What the fuck? Magic? Spongy Bob, how are you still Spongy Bob! <laughs> Spongy Bobu! The funniest thing about Spongy Bobu is now that I know Japanese, it totally makes sense why they have to call him Spongy Bobu. Why? Because, um,. In, in Japanese, they don't have uh, like every every sound ends on a vowel. Sure. They have like their letters or characters. Okay. It's like ka ki ku ke ko. Okay. And like sa shi su se so. So they always end on a vowel. Sure. So they can't end on 
they can't just say Bob. <laughs> <laughs> to them, if they tried to say Bob, it would be two characters. It would be B O and B U, probably. Oh. They could do Ba Ba. Like B O B O, but I don't think that's right. Yeah. I don't know what goes into them picking what that vowel should end on if they have to like make it up. Yeah. But Spun G Balbu. I guess it makes sense. Spongy Babu. Spongy Babu. I just remember when that fucking that video came out. I remember watching it on fucking like equals three. That's how long yeah. ago it was. I don't know the logistics of Japanese. It's definitely, I think, one of my favorite languages to hear. It's so pretty to hear. Yeah. That's what always like hooks me back in. Is like when I would just like hear Italian, I'd be like, okay, Italians, fine. Uh, I, I, uh, my family wanted me to learn Italian. Is that why you took it? Yeah. <laughs> we took it. We took it together. Yeah, we take it together. And our teacher called us like. Stupid brothers or something. Yeah, that was weird. Because we, because I mean, we were, we always sat next to each other, and we were consistently failing that. Class. Yeah. <laughs> um, Which is like fine. <laughs> I figured. I tried so many languages before Japanese. Yeah. Well, didn't you take? You took I, French. I took French. You took I Latin? took Latin. I took Italian and Spanish. Counting obviously, Spanish. Yeah. Um, speaking of what, speaking of Spanish, um, I'm still going through all of my, uh, all of my old VHS tapes and converting them to, to digital. Right. Um, and I found a clip of me singing, uh, Head, Shoulders, Knees, and Toes. Cabeza! In Spanish. <laughs> yeah, I, um, I remember. I remember doing that. It was like my... My family missed the presentation we did for it, so my mom filmed me at home doing it by myself. <laughs> the most interesting thing about that, though, is... I'm pretty sure that's the earliest record I have of me singing on my own. Oh, really? I, I, it's like the youngest footage I found that I can hear myself singing with, like, not in a choir or anything. No way! That was, uh, was kind of interesting. And I'm like, yeah, I'm not, I'm not tone deaf as a young kid either. No, yeah. That's actually really cool. I wish I had that kind of thing. I remember- there's a picture of me that exists, um, in my family, my aunt used to live in Hawaii, hmm. so, and she met her husband, my, my uncle out there, so she, um, she had her wedding out there, and so we went out there for the wedding, obviously, mm -hmm. and we were staying in my uncle's Coast Guard, um, mm. so we were staying in, like, the fucking, um, military kind of like vacation housing and one of the guys that had a that was also there um had a guitar and i my mom like took a picture of me holding the guitar oh. and that's like one of the earliest i think i i, that, I think that was 2005 i was maybe eight oh. and i think that's like one of the earliest um depictions of me holding an instrument interesting um, oh actually i lied my my aunt's my other aunt her ex-husband was in a band and had like a recording studio in his house and i we went and we stayed with them I me mean, i had to have been like three or four years old yeah. and i like went in there and my uncle was like doing something and he was like yeah come here like he like picked me up and he was showing me he had a fucking board dude this thing was <laughs> Huge, but I, I, he was like, get here, like, here's a guitar, like, he put a guitar on my lap and like, was uh -huh. like, you gotta like move your hands, like you gotta strum like this, but you gotta like move your hands and stuff, um, like up and down the neck, and so I was like doing that, and I was like, I like this, this is cool, <laughs> and then my mom took a video of it, mm. and that is somewhere. Well, uh, we should probably end this video because we finished that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. So we'll finish it now. Um. 
we'll do this one. And then, uh, once we do this part, um, we'll go up and fight Ganon. So, that'll be on the next episode, though. Oh, oh, oh. It's so close. Oh. Yeah, we're pretty close. Oh, yeah. Maybe one or two uh, more episodes. Okay, cool. Uh, see you then. All right, bye, guys.